Poor pass from Dundala. And Kilmarnock on the back foot again. Thompson. Gets it back from Larson, and Henrik Larson in for his hat trick. Thompson and Larson combined, and there was never much doubt as Larson went through on Gordon Marshall that he was squeezed this in. Three for Larson, two for Sutton, five for Celtic, and Kilmarnock in big bother. Fulton's lost it to McNamara. Johnson and Henrik Larson, chance for number five. It is five. It trickled over the line, but that won't bother most people inside the stadium. And it won't bother Henrik Larsson. Now 21 goals for the season after it was lost by Fulton in midfield. And full punishment was forthcoming for him. and has the chance to get to himself. It's Larson! A perfect penalty from a perfect player. And it's a barnstorming start for Celtic. Yeah, he doesn't miss too many. It's wrong foots, David Priest there. Stepping up for the... That's his end. Well, the goalkeeper certainly guessed correctly. Tenth minute of the game, Celtic go ahead deservedly. David Hanna over the ball. Stubbs and Rupert both in the box. That's him at last Larson found some room in the penalty area and he makes the penalty pay. So within three minutes, Celtic are back on level terms. What a cultured bit of finishing that was from Henrik Larson. O'Donnell, Larson going back into the box and there he is again, yes! The opening goal! This afternoon, well, maybe a use of an arm there by Donnelly, but he plays it through now to Larson. And Celtic take the lead. With 26 minutes played, it's Henrik Larson, his four goals, who's joining Celtic. Celtic's turned through Larson. Larson has scored. Henrik Larson, right out of nothing, has made Apple pay. They needed to get a goal to make their dominance count. Instead of that, they've conceded one. Celtic's top scorer has hit his ninth of the season. There's Larson, he must put it away again, and he does. Simple, clinical. Two touches from midfield. Wonderful vision by Beduka to allow his colleague to run onto that. And just at a time when Hodge looks as if he might break forward. Almaravchik looking for Larson. Is he on the end of this? And with Larson, a fine strike to open the scoring after 24 minutes. 
It's Henrik Larsson's seventh goal of the season. Larsson kept his eye on this ball as it dropped. The keeper advanced and the perfect lob put Celtic one up. McNamara, laid off by Larsson, through from Blinker, the back heel from Viduka, cut out by Solberg, danger is not over, and it's Henrik Larsson! That's two in two minutes from Larsson, and Celtic 3-0 up. No respite for the Aberdeen defence. Lovely ball in this time from Moravcik, and again, the deftest of touches from Larsson. Neil Lennon, good ball from Larson to Moravcik, driven in low at the near post, here's Henrik Larson. could it be number four for Larson? It could. 6-0 Celtic, unstoppable, and you just knew, despite the odds being stuck against him initially, that Henrik Larson would find the way to goal. playing it in behind the St. Pants defence, Larson in, in the goalkeeper, he's round the goalkeeper, Henrik Larson, there it is! Celtic 2-0 up, and that finishes this match, Henrik Larson, beautiful pass in and behind the defence, took it round the goalkeeper, 2-0. Obi, back header was short, and Henrik Larson punishes them! We're into the last minute. Larson, wait, he's done it! Larson with a snap shot has won it for Celtic. Uh, I think I come as a striker, but I didn't come as uh, like a goal-scoring striker with a with a reputation of scoring a lot of goals. Um, it didn't. I didn't succeed that well in Holland on that bit. In Sweden, it was a little bit better. But when I came here, I think he intended to use me as an offensive midfield player. But yeah, due to the circumstances, he had to move me up, up the pitch. And uh, he liked what he saw up there. And uh, I started scoring a few goals. And um, ever since, I've been playing in that position. I always regard myself as a striker, but not like a, like a penalty box striker. More like you enjoy, um, uh, um, yeah. How do you say that? Um, participate in the in the place. I mean, um, yeah, layoffs and everything. I don't like just standing still in the in the box and wait for the ball. I would like to be all over the place. Good position now for Petrov. Larson, great play, no offside, could have been a second, it is. That's a glorious goal. It's Henrik Larson, who's over the ball, the referee, and was telling the Aberdeen defenders to move Let's back just a shade. One. Yeah, <laughs> it was my birthday. <laughs> it was Aberdeen, that's good. Two or three. Three goals, and that was my second, I think, free kick. It's Henrik Larsson, Celtic 2, Aberdeen 0. A brilliantly struck free kick, which gave Jim Leighton absolutely no chance. He seemed to hit it with such great ease. I just saw the space, and uh, I wanted to put it there, and just, uh, just went in. Absolute brilliance. When you, when you hit it, you feel feel how it's going to be. When, when, once you strike it, you feel if it's going to be close or not. And then you can't tell until you see the, the end result. So oh, that's his fifth goal since joining Celtic. Brilliant piece of play, right into the corner. That was one of the lucky ones. <laughs> but thankfully we have other uh, free kick takers in the club as well, in Muravšik, so that's, that's all right.
delivers the corner. And Henrik Larsson has equalised for Celtic. It's 1-1. his line there, good ball whipped in by Thompson, loads of pace on it, a dick advocate will be feeling that's a free header. Free kick that will be taken by Bobby Petter, Petter delivers, Larson's header, he's done it again, it's a double for Henrik Larson, it's number five for Celtic. Well once again it's a wonderful goal Ian, but once again you have to question the marking in the back for Rangers. Delivery whipped in by Petter, but look at the room that Henrik Larsson has. Barry Ferguson, the nearest to him, and he's three yards off him. And it doesn't get any easier for strikers than this. But of what's still to be done, though, and Larsson applies the deathest of headers to find the corner. Henrik Larsson scores his 57th league goal in 84 matches for Celtic. Well, there's, I think, the referee is saying that's the second goal. Larson follows through and gets a second goal as a youngster Robert Malcolm was left stranded there on his own against the most lethal attacker in the United Kingdom and he got in such a tangle perfectly correct decision by the referee well he could have bust an head at the end there but all he needed to do was take it there and then touch it in Rangers woefully exposed in defence. With a clean break there. Well, that's him, yes. Cleanly taken. He's hardly been in the game. But then, that's the mark of quality. And we've seen it in different circles this week already by men who can score goals out of virtually nothing. We saw Simone do it. We saw last long do it, and I that man there. for Sutton, Nick Bakio, down goes Petro. Thompson, he skipped away from Tomasek. Thompson centre, and look who's in there! That is brilliant, and Celtic clinically claim their second goal, and it's a double for Henrik Larsson. Uh, came out of nothing, it's the same call as well, Alan Thompson did so much again, and Niemi left absolutely stranded, a wonderful goal. Henrik Larsson's 34th goal of the season.